wonder how my videos are doing. Hey, that has a lot of views. Eh, that doesn't. Holy shit! What's up, everyone? So, we somehow hit 100 subscribers. I really don't know how. My content isn't that great. But thank you to everyone that has subscribed over the years. I kind of had a special plan, but, like, I had ideas planned, but it came up way quicker than I thought. Because when I was planning those ideas, I was at, like, 97 subscribers. And, you know, I, I was sort of thinking, like, okay, I maybe I'm gonna do, like, a fire sprinkler activation or, like, a destruction vi No, it just happened. I just checked my YouTube today, and I was at 100 subscribers. So, thank you so much for that. And, um, well, I don't really have anything special planned, like I said. So, I guess I'm gonna show you around some projects that you might remember, give you some updates on them as well as some projects you have not seen, like that fire alarm demo board back there. Okay, so first off, this is my fire alarm demo board. Uh, I had a Wheelock MT mounted here, but I forgot why I took it off. It's fully functional though, I just don't have it up. Hate this solid core wire, by the way. Um, I'm not gonna really explain much of this. This is just kind of a board with some simple circuits. We have an EST Integrity and a 270 SBO. Um, you guys have seen the YouTube short of this exit sign where I put RGB bulbs in it and mounted it on the wall a little while ago. The fire alarm panel is pretty much the same. Um, however, I do have some more plans for it. So first off, I want to replace this speaker wire with fire alarm cable. I want to do something with the resettable power and alarm relay to basically make audible silence. Um, I'll explain how that works, maybe. But yeah, that's the panel. Um, I actually was going to replace this with a low frequency sounder, but the freaking eBay guy scammed me, so I didn't get my low frequency sounder. I got my money back though, so that's pretty nice. You guys remember this fridge? Yeah, well it's still going, and actually this fridge is the reason why I got into my engineering high school. Or, not really, STEM high school, that's what it would be called. Um, yeah, I just submit like a one minute video about this project that I did. And, uh, yeah, this fridge is still running, in case anyone's wondering about it. Now we're in my basement. Oh! That's where my Wheelock MT is. Huh. So, you actually, you might be able to tell I got another subwoofer. And I'm like, well, I kind of want ear-destroying bass, so I got a second one. And, yeah, that's really nice. This computer is still working just fine. Um, let me pop the side panel here. Actually, I threw the Wheelock MT at this computer kind of on accident, and it, like kind of freaked out. Alright, pop the side panel. There's everything that I did. I want to upgrade this RAM to 4 gigabytes. Maybe I might do that soon, who knows. Something I wanted to make a video on uh, several times now over the course of two years but I haven't is my outdoor movie theater setup. Um, there is an Elite Screens Yardmaster 2 in there, and in that gray bag that says Vankio is a projector. Um, so yeah, I wanted to show you guys that, but I don't know, there, I couldn't really make a great video about it. Yeah, I wanted to make a video on the fog machine as well, I actually don't know if this thing works anymore. I guess we'll have to see. Um, this is gonna be used for a fire alarm voicey back on the demo board. But like, I don't even have the demo board finished, so that's not going to be for a while. So that's about it. Thank you guys so much for 100 subscribers, and I'll see you in the next one. My eyes! And my first of all, my eyes for the first time!